Oh, we're going right into it. Everyone today is speedy, speedy, speedy. I love that. We're going oh right into my. a tight okay. game one with numbers and Carflow at the ready. And Carflow is... It, it, oh. He's just crom. He's, cook, he's he, going. He's also just crom, crom, crom today. And honestly, he's had such a good crom bracket. And John just dies so early. It's only been 30 seconds and his stock is already gone. But he is capable of matching Carflow's speed with this Wii Fit trainer. Let's see if we get a Gimp here. Yeah, he's dead. And <laughs> two okay. stocks apiece. And we're 45 seconds nice in. Game. You know what? What, what, do the, what do the commentators always say? Oh my god, we're playing Smash 4. Ha ha. Ha ha, we didn't play Smash 4. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't play Smash 4. Ha yes. ha. Oh my god, we're playing Smash 4 Ultimate. No, but uh, yeah, this is this, 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 this probably really, a really fast game. Maybe that Carfo is playing. Maybe that Numbers wants to play. Maybe that Carfo is trying to delete these stocks as fast as possible. If you have money on Carfo right now, Put uh, put up in the air because I think Carfo is playing out of his mind. All right, forty percent on numbers and numbers has no numbers on the board. He is not putting. Oh, never mind. He's like, <laughs> okay, right, stop it's there. It's all it takes. My turn. Yep, <laughs> take a timeout, buddy. All right. Well, Mont never is in timeout for caster cursing. Carfo here has this lead trap going, and he wants to take this to the bank. Down throw, but no follow up. John has the deep breathing online. Carflows look so dominant with these ledge traps all day. Let's see if he can keep it going. I hope so, Cobb. I'm loving these downs. I'm loving catching, you know, just tracking numbers' his options whenever he is kind of stuck in this situation where I can't roll in, I can't neutral get up, I can't jump, and then boom, we're getting an instant run back because Carflow just wow. ran with this stop, this game. Yeah. Carflow... He's, had, he's also had a long time to warm up. I mean... Oh, yeah, that's true. He lost to Pussy King in winner and to get out of his pool. I say that again. Sorry. How was to say on, on comms? PK. I was... Oh! PK? My fault. PK. They were saying it out there, so I thought it was okay. Yeah, they were saying it out there and over the intercom, but I didn't know how to pronounce okay, it here. Okay, but Carflow, I mean... He beat Wafru, who beat me round one, popped off, whatever. Beat Avon, beat Krugbo, beat EJJ, beat Vivi. He just has all this momentum right now, and it feels like he's just a train that can't be stopped. The it's only thing working that way, yeah. The only thing that could stop him was Little Mac. <laughs> oh, you're oh, oh great you're tech. Excellent, and Garfro has to start taking those because Numbers is not afraid of just you know dropping down and doing any of three options and getting from out of here as fast as possible because you saw how fast that stock, those stocks were deleted. Carful is on a roll. Carful wants the W today. Absolutely. Great there from John, though, going all the way up there to hit the top of the Krom Uppy. And these two have had a pretty, like, I'm pretty sure recently Carflow is actually, like, uh, the the head-to-head -head has been in his favor as of late, which is, I know he used to complain so much about playing against John, and John, yeah. John definitely doesn't want to be, you know, giving Carflow all these wins. I feel like that the last time I remember them Fami was Carflow yes. winning against Numbers like a couple months ago. And it was at a Zeno, I think. Yeah, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was on stream. It was I everything. Think, I think Carflow actually won that Zeno. Oh. Holy Carflow W. Yeah. And he is just pressuring like a guy who wants to win another Zeno. <laughs> okay. Okay. That was a little funny. John <laughs> walking towards the knockdown Krom. Let's see if Carflow can convert on this ledge trap. A great back throw. Oh, I, I, Carflow is oh, being a little God, bit too aggressive on ledge. Super, super scary. Good tech on that part, but we got to be we gotta really, kind of really back in. Remember, we are fighting against Numbers, who has, you know, all these great options, all these arrow options off stage. I, it, Krom cannot fuss whatever contest with Uppy for so long. Nope. Great forward air. Not quite going to kill, though. I'm going to be shot. surprised. Yeah. yeah. Good DI from John, I guess. All right, excellent. Just the, the ledge hang from Weefit is so <laughs> good, but I love the F tilt. Nice, clean, and super fast. Just kind of getting that option out of the way. Carflow. This is, a, this is not definitely not undoable, uh, not entirely impossible at 93%. As we're seeing, the tracking, the lead, uh, the following through as well is so good. Even going as far as getting numbers off stage like that is so good. Now we have a, we don't, I don't think we have a jump at disposal, just a beat, yeah. Yeah, but it was a great header from John to stem the bleeding and pick up a reversal out of the corner. Carflow is selling so hot, but John is, he, whenever he gets his spots, he picks his opening, he's getting so much out of it. And I love his mix-up with the header offstage, using it or not using it. Because if it peaks above, it's just enough to get Carflow to back off a little bit. And that little bit of space is giving John everything he needs to just, you know, not get exploded. And gets the deep breathing back online here, so maybe something explosive coming in the future. 
Carfos Twin is a really good spot right here. This should be a really excellent rush out situation where it goes favorably. Getting the uppy kill as well is such a great uh, trade off in order to come out to save up to be safely. Now we're going to be seeing another uh, down th uh, up throw into the uh, the down air. Not down, down air. Why are they down air for? The fair. And just kind of utilizing Crumb's speed and Crumb's big ol' hitboxes to his advantage. Yeah, and this is John tournament stock. I mean, but, yeah, not but, something you say every day. Oh my god, it. Fair Bear. That's not it. It looked like it was it. I got jump scared. Yeah, but I'm forget surprised. that DI is so, so excellent here. Yeah. Let's see if Carfo can get some. He's just waiting menacingly on this platform and drops down with the forward air, perfectly hitting John's getup. Let's see. All right. I love the up air off the ledge. Yeah, the number's classic. Just interrupting people who go for that greedy Ooh. spike through the ledge. Let's see if Carfo can recover. Oh, he does it again! He does it again. This guy's a wizard. He just pulls him out of nowhere. He is thinking. Oh my god. Carfo is thinking right now. Do we go to Croy? The, go, the Roy? Do you go to the Roy? I mean... No, nah, I wouldn't. Just I feel Kron. like you can't. I just... You, got, you made a statement. He lost this game because he just gave up the ledge trap because he tried to denner John on his way up. And this is where everybody loses their games against John. It's because they get a little too greedy trying to punish the Wii Fit. Suddenly you let them out of the corner, and then it's over. And he just hits you with some magic like thing he pulls out of thin air. Yeah, and then, and then once you get numbers in like in like have a game three back, uh, your back is to the wall situation. He flourishes. Oh my god! I've yeah. seen it. You, you, he flourishes. He gets suddenly every single hit. He gets every single deep breathing. He gets every roll away from every hit. It works so beautifully for numbers. Especially when he's on his last tournament stock, it's like, or he had three, but last game of the tournament of his uh, uh, loser side stock, it's like, ah, this is where he shines. Yes. He's so good at all. He's just so good at playing like the mental aspect of the game, the conditioning aspect of the game. Hits Carflow with the side B to get back to stage, but Carflow with the grab. His grabs have been fire all day, and a great up air. And then back air is gonna pick it up. Nice back air. Nice bear. Yeah, John shook his head. Maybe a little displeased with that, but he's not going down without a fight. You know it. Oh my god. Oof. That did like 20. It's an install, man. I'm telling you. It's truly a, a, little, a little messed up, but it's okay. Yeah, let's a see. The deep breathing's gone, so John is going to have to work a little harder for this kill. Great sun salutation. Yeah, gets a little bit of healing for your efforts. Love the back here, you know, to interrupt Carflow's approach. Trying to re try Carflow is trying so hard to reset the situation, and Numbers just shut him down at every step. Yeah, and Numbers, he, he just picked out where Carflow... He, he shot the sun as the uppy was starting, which is proof that he just knows. Oh my god, the ball the, dropped. The, the scare, it was so scary. Okay, the, the, the tension there was like, you could cut it with a knife. Oh yeah, man. Sadly, I don't have a knife. Otherwise, I would have cut it. What the? That what roll. Roll Yeah. <laughs> we both saw this. What a roll. Yeah, John gets his deep breathing back online. Carver here waiting on the platform. And a trade here. Honestly, I think if you're John, you're really happy with the trade. That deep breathing down tilt hits so far away. The footstool? Are you kidding me? Yeah, when you start footstooling people on purpose, oh, it's he, time to no, go. He knows. It's he, time he, to go. He knows he's good. <laughs> He knows he's good. Like, Carflow is in the it's so over part of the chart. Yeah, but let's see if Carflow can, uh, you know, become we're so back. I hope we can, because we, we see a really good position here for Carflow that should work out. Numbers off stage, numbers has to come back to say that's a ledge. Gets the forward throw as well. Gets the deep green, a little bit of healing as well, but can we see Carflow pull out a back air? That's what I'm hoping for right here, but I love the soccer like ball. There and it is. Yes, we do see it. Boom, bam, bop. Yeah, you're That's a great a commentator. Point. You called that one out before it happened. Oh, thank God. Yeah, man. I get worse sometimes. <laughs> 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 yeah, numbers here. It's last stock game three between these two. It's such a high paced set. 64 on car flow, 78. Numbers is doing so much damage, but the deep breathing is gone. This is where car flow can start to make this comeback. The sun, unpunishable on shield. Too much stun there because he crossed up. Should be able to make a comeback, honestly, 91%. I know it's a little bit scary against some like numbers, but he doesn't have deep breathing. He doesn't have any... I don't think he has much sun citation charge regardless. Dash tag is not going to be the option here as we see that up to all. And we see, we might, be seeing, might be seeing numbers get that uh, that adaptation underway, get that advantage state really spiraling where it's it feels like, like you're yeah. suffocating. The car flow here with four up airs. 
but John has deep breathing back online. That's the punishment you get for hitting Weefa into disadvantage, as screwed up as that is. Let's see if Carplo can get anything big. He's at 135, but Krom has such explosive kill power, a Jeff Smash could do it in the corner. So Jeff Smash? Jab F Smash, sorry. Oh. <laughs> it's just something my friends and I say, it's just a habit. No, it's so real. Carplo, 158%. What can we see? We're on the ledge. We see Numbers is threatening. Numbers is messed up. That's so brutal. He was he threatening the back air the entire time by just yeah. jumping in place over and over again, threatening, if you jump towards me, I'm going to kill you. That was like a sortie ledge And he turns around and he's just like,